phase rug gaming fans what is up i'm back and i'm gaming and i don't know if this is gonna work because i've been trying to record a gaming video all morning and my program just keeps crashing i have no idea why but i've been playing warzone for the past couple days and it's addicting and it's making me play call of duty all day and it reminds me of my old days okay so here i am making a gaming video for you guys and if this is up on youtube that means it didn't crash but we're just gonna get right into it if you guys have been playing call of duty warzone let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of it i think it's amazing i think it's like a way to bring all the gamers back and especially with with you know the sickness going around everybody's at home playing and streaming so if you're one of those people smash that like button and i wish you guys nothing but luck but i'm not even going to make any excuses as to why i haven't been uploading on my gaming channel it is simply because my programs keep crashing and anybody that i've asked to help has given me like solutions but then it only works for like a few hours and then it just crashes again so i'm thinking it's just my pc which I hope not because it's a very expensive build, but I might have to send it back. But with this whole virus going around, I'm definitely going to be gaming a lot more and hopefully making more gaming videos once I fix my PCs. And I'm not going to make any promises because anytime I do that, I just never hold them and you guys get mad at me. But here we are, guys. Battle Royale on freaking Call of Duty. Who would have ever thought that this would be a thing? So I personally haven't won a game. I've played about like 20 games. I haven't even gotten close, but you know, when you don't play Call of Duty for a few years and you're trying to come back, you're a little rusty. I'm gonna try extra hard because this is my first game actually filming. So let's do it, baby. I don't know if this is just me, but in Battle Royale games, like I like landing already in the circle. So I don't have to worry about anything, but we're about to land at stadium. I actually haven't landed there, so. I don't know. I think downtown is the most poppin' place that you can land. So we're gonna we're gonna stay away from that because I know that's not gonna work out. All right, here we go. Let me just land straight on a gun. Oh wait, is that never never mind? I guess, dude. If someone gets a gun up here, I'm screwed. All right, so I don't think there's any guns at the top of the stadium. Oh, this this is one of my favorite parts. If you're on like a high building, you could literally just jump off and parachute and just go somewhere else. I'm just gonna jump. Let's see where we could head. Okay, I hear some action. Oh, why? Why did I do that? He has a gun too. Should I even go for it? I think I'm still gonna go for it. Oh, watch this. Watch this, guys. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Oh, he got a rocket launcher. Oh, I killed him! What? With a pistol? Come on, man. Yo, it's FaZe Rug here. You, you guys already know how I be. Dude, why would he not just use a scar? Oh, I have two armor? Okay. Yo, we're chilling. If I win this first game filming, like, that would be lit. I want to see... I want to see a bunch of likes. I don't know the expectations on my gaming channel for likes, but can we try to shoot for 30,000? I think I think 30,000 should be a good amount. I love the buy station. I love everything about this war zone. Like, everything about it is perfect to me. Like... There's a buy station. You could buy this like supply drop that you could get your in-game classes, uh, but it's $6,000. So you have to collect cash. I'm sure you guys have all played it if you're watching this video, but if not, you guys need to get on that. Like it's, it's just insane. And it's kind of crazy with the timing, like with everything going on in the world right now, like Warzone drops and oh my God, I can't even imagine the market right now. I can't imagine how many people are playing this game, but uh, I, I'm pretty happy because, guys, I know a lot of people think I don't game. I literally play video games every single day. I play Counter-Strike a lot. Counter-Strike has been my game, my go-to game. But after this dropped, oh my god. I just can't stop playing it. So when you go to the buy station, there's like shield turret, cluster strike, gas mask, precision air strike, UAV, self-revive kit, which is good. Uh, munitions box. Okay, ammo. And then the loadout drop marker. You want the loadout drop marker because that's when you get your in-game classes. And to me, guys, the gaming world is literally one big family. Like, I, I just love how there's a ton more people gaming. But the one person that I know will never game, if you guys could guess, he's related to me, my brother. I don't know why. He just, like, it's all about basketball. But the gyms are shut down and, like, oh, I don't know. It's, it's all bad for him. He's not in a good state of mind right now. <laughs> okay. We need some action. Yeah, I'm never, ever landing stadium again. This is horrible. Very boring. I'm sorry, but right now, this takes the cake over Fortnite. Like, I, I like Fortnite. Actually, I'm not going to lie. I, I don't like Fortnite anymore. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't attack me. I just don't like Fortnite anymore. It's just, 
after like season two, season three, I stopped playing because like, uh, I guess you could say I just started sucking and everyone was better than me. So <laughs> it's not really a good excuse. The only thing I'm picturing happening right now is my game shutting down. Cause like it's happened to me 10 times already, but this is the longest I've gone without it shutting down. So, uh, that wasn't wood. I've never driven the cargo truck. Who would have ever thought phase rug would be saying that again? Loving call of duty. Let's go, baby. This is it. There's a whole squad here. Oh. Go get the loot. Go get the loot. Oh my goodness. Oh, yep. Ah, I feel like everyone's just so good at this game now. All right, 200 IQ, 200 IQ. Will it tell me if they're getting revived? Ah, there was a whole squad. There's nothing I could do there, but the best part about this game, I'm so glad I died actually, because I'm gonna I'm gonna get revived. I never lose in the gulag match. So for those who don't play this yet, when you die, you have a chance to get revived back into the game. You just have to win a 1v1. And I'm lit at 1v1s, let me tell you. And you get to watch other people while you wait. This is so sick. But here we go. Let me just let me just get revived back into the game. Watch this. Oh shit. Oh, just because I talked, just because I talked, guys. Hey, hey, come on, man. So if you win this and then you die again, you don't go back in the gulag shower because you, you obviously got the first chance. Now you just got to find loot again, but there's so much loot everywhere. So, uh-oh, looks like this place has been looted. Yep, it's been looted. Oh, someone got a loadout drop. That means they're right there. You see it on the map? Oh my God, I can't be that close to people without guns i need okay i mean i'll take this for now but it's probably a whole squad dude is that bait is that bait i don't see anybody but if i could get there i could get oh yep i see someone right there guys watch this two people uh, i don't know if i want to blow my cover oh crap how did i get no no it's so hard solo 36th place not bad i mean it's just so hard solo because you could run into a 1v3. Somebody actually told me in the pregame lobby, if you get a kill, you get like actual like speed in the real thing. I don't know if that's true, but like watch this, you know, you know how I be. Oh, he took the helicopter. I've seen people post some crazy clips like, oh, quick scope with a crossbow. If only that was the real thing. All right, I'm gonna land somewhere popping. I'm gonna land downtown, okay? Because we need some action in this video. We need, we need like, 10 kills right off the bat. It's just crazy to me how, like, the whole world is changing. Like, it literally feels like a zombie apocalypse is about to happen. Like, if you guys went to any grocery store, you'd know what I'm talking about. Like, everything is empty, and it's, like, really scary. But here we go. Here we go. I just need to land somewhere fire. Like, okay, okay. At least I'll land. Nope. RPG. Ah, oh, God. It's not. It's just not a good start. Another RPG. Wow. Okay, I downed him. I downed him. His team is here, though, for sure. What? Wait, I need a gun. Ooh. Guys, it's just like, what can I do? You know what? I know what I could do is win this 1v1 and go back in the game. And if I don't win this, then uh, you could all unsubscribe. Unsubscribe from the Phase Rug Games channel. That's how confident I am, man. This guy's for sure dead. He's choking it. He's nervous. Look at this. This dude is nervous. He's out. Boo. Boo! Uh-oh. Oh, there it is. Oh, he won. He won. Come on, baby. I got this. Easy win. Easy dubs. Oh, I hit him. Oh, no. What just happened? What just happened? Did I lose? So, I don't know if you guys have seen it yet, but FaZe just copped. A $30 million home. And it's crazy. And it's insane. Justin Bieber used to live there. And Justin Bieber is one of my favorite human beings of all time. And I hope one day I get to meet him. Mark my words. This year in May is FaZe Clan's 10 year anniversary. And it all started with video games. It all started with like COD 4, MW2 trick shotting. Like literally spinning in circles and shooting someone and killing someone. And it's so, 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 so crazy to me that like it led to this it led to like living in a 30 million dollar home it led to like being recognized in public everywhere you go and i think it's one of the dopest things in the world 
all from Call of Duty. Like, that's the crazy part about it. And you know how video games were looked down on and frowned upon back in the day? Like, oh, video games, you can't make money, you can't do anything. Bro, we proved them wrong. So I just want to thank you guys for all the support and, like, a lot of people might see it as like, oh, you're flexing a $30 million home. But to me, it's not considered flexing. It's kind of just showing you guys our accomplishments and what you could possibly do one day if you grind. So uh, just remember, FaZe Clan started with nothing. I love telling that story, honestly. It got deep real quick. Okay. If I lose this gulag, I'm, I'm ending the video. So you could probably tell by like the length of the video. But I was literally probably the first person who just died. Oh god, this guy looks good. Oh, okay, guys, guys, I'm sorry. I'm not starting another game. That's it. I hope everything filmed properly, but I'm going to end the video there. I hope you all did enjoy another Phase Rug Games video. And I had a great time playing Call of Duty. If you guys want to see more, please smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And hopefully the next video will be me actually winning a Warzone game because I'm just going to keep grinding all day and filming. So I love you guys so much. Other than that, it's been FaZe Rug, and I'm out. Peace.